How's it going guys and welcome back. In this video, we're going to be checking out the location of all 26 collectibles in the second mission of Wolfenstein Youngblood called Riverside. So the first one is going to be 3D glasses number 3 and it can be found here right at the beginning of the mission by climbing up this ladder. Now we call it 3D glasses number 3, though it's the first one we collect. We're going by the in-game menu order and this one shows up as the third one, hence why we're calling this one number 3. Now I have taken the liberty of killing off any remaining enemies in the level and we're going to do this without any jump cuts between areas just to make sure nobody gets lost. We want to progress through to the area with the boss. Here we're going to take a left until we get into this little cage room. Inside here we're going to find a newspaper. This is going to be readable collectible number one. From here cross the road to the other side and go through the hallway here to the left. As soon as we get in this next room on the table we'll be able to find the readable collectible number two. Once we open up this next door and climb up the stairs, as soon as we get to the next opening, we want to look over to the left and on the ground we'll be able to find 3D glasses collectible number 1. Now almost immediately behind us, if we continue through the next hallway, we'll be able to find our UVK cover number 1. And a tiny bit further forwards, to the left we'll come across this red door. Now to open up these red doors, we will need to unlock the crusher power-up. So we can go into the menu and simply unlock that. Now we have the crusher ability, we can sprint through these red doors, and inside here we'll be able to find a red box. This is going to be the first of our concept art collectibles. Now the code to open this box is going to be 9576. You won't have the combination for this box quite yet, as it is obtained from one of the floppy disks later on in the level. But this will save you the hassle of coming back later on. Now exit out of this little secret room, and in the main office behind us, we'll be able to find the next readable collectible on the table, which is going to be readable number 3. Directly behind us on these make-do shelves, we're going to find the cassette tape number 2. And this room is really packed solid with collectibles. Directly behind us again on the main desks, we're going to be able to find floppy disk number 2. Now we want to exit out of this room, but before heading through the co-op door to get through to the next objective area, we're going to look behind these barricades to the left, and we're going to be able to find 3D glasses number 2. Now after we've opened up the co-op door to progress through the mission, run through the second hallway and on the right hand side we'll be able to see a load of post boxes. Inside one of these post boxes will be a letter sticking out and this is going to be readable collectible number 4. Continue through to the next area after you've opened up the door and here we're going to directly jump through this window to the left and climb all the way to the top floor. There will be a lot of enemies in this area that you will want to clear out first. At the top of the stairs, immediately to the right, we're going to find next to the concept art red boxes. The combination to open up this one is going to be 2703. In the same top floor, we're going to be able to find also cassette number 3 sitting on the table. Now if we jump out this window, we'll land on this platform where we can find floppy disk number 4 and immediately beside it there'll be a floppy disk decoder machine we can use to obtain the codes to open up the rest of the concept boxes. You can also access this area by climbing up the ladder. Now if we jump down between this crashed car and the tree, there's going to be another post box with readable number 5 inside. Now here where the road forks off, we want to take the right hand side and smash the glass. Inside we'll be able to grab 3D glasses number 4. Then immediately above the jukebox, we want to jump onto this roof doing a little bit of parkour, and up here we'll be able to find a secret room we can access by the window. Inside the secret room, we'll be able to find the UVK cover number 2. Jump back down from the roof and continue to the end of this hallway and then jump on the back of this truck to access the higher platform. Here we can find our third concept red box which the password is going to be 1234 to open it and this is going to be concept number 3. Immediately behind it before we go through the hallway we can also find 3D glasses number 5. Continue up the stairs to the open area and behind the fountain we'll be able to find readable number 6.
Now backtrack halfway down the staircase to the left and we'll find floppy disk number three. Continue all the way to the bottom of the stairs and down here to the left on these sort of burning chairs and tables we'll be able to find 3D glasses number 6. Now we are finally done with this area right here which has been a very very collectible heavy sort of section of this mission. And now it's finally time to go through another co-op door to access the last area of this mission. Through here we want to kill off a few more enemies and then go behind this landing pod machine and on the far left table we'll be able to find 3D glasses number 7. Now on a few tables over to the right we'll be able to find also readable number 7. For the 3D glasses number 8 we're going to jump on top of this train cabin and again here we're going to need the crush ability so once we have that unlocked we're going to double jump and then press circle or the B button to smash down into the cabin giving us access to 3D glasses number 8. Once we have these, now there's only one more collectible remaining in this level, so we want to jump back out of the train and go down into the subway as if we're going to end the mission. And just before we get to the end, we'll be able to find the final readable number 8 sitting here on this stool. So those are the locations of all 26 collectibles in the Riverside mission of Wolfenstein Young Wolf. I hope you did find this very helpful guys. If you did, don't forget that thumbs up button, subscribe for more content coming very soon, and we'll see you next time.